Hey guys, what's up? It's Ash here. Uh, how are you guys all doing today? I'm doing pretty good. Um, I have been stuck in my house for two-ish weeks now, so I get to actually go outside today to my dance class that I've missed for the past few weeks. So I'm very excited about that, not gonna lie. Today I decided to have my first video be a bookshelf tour. Um, Personally, I think that you can find out a lot about somebody based off of what books they read, so I'm going to be doing that. Um, I have two-ish small bookshelves, and then I have three back there, which we'll get to. So yeah, that's what we're going to be doing today. I have so much planned for, the, for this week, the next two weeks. Um, I made a game up for a monthly TBR because those are well known now and so I'm gonna try that for the first time um, and I should film it. I'm filming it in exactly one week. So yeah, expect that to come out on the 1st of May. I also have a wrap up for the month and I have a lot of just fun stuff coming so stay tuned for that if you want. <laughs> so without further ado, let's just hop into the shelf tour. So first we have these shelves right here. They're kind of messy because this is my only desk because I have my couch over here, but I have these three shelves and I'm just gonna go on a more in depth. So on my first shelf, I have my Bible stuff, um, my memory box, my Alexa, some old little pet shops and candle that I'll never use. So yeah. On the second shelf, I just have random miscellaneous ones. I didn't know where to put these, so I just kind of put them here. I have my all Alex and Eliza trilogy, and then my, my dog's purpose duology, and then this one. Um, I have Frankenstein, which I have read. Um, one of the few books that I own that I've actually read. My opinion about it, if you're wondering. I read the graphic novel by Gris Grimley, and I hated Victor. Not his drawing, but just... I hate Victor with the passion. He's one of my least favorite characters that I've ever read about. Then I have this one. It's signed. I've read Dear Evan Hansen. Did not like that one that much either, but you know, whatever. And then Solo, which I'm tempted to read. This is just my miscellaneous shelf. So next are just some standalones that are also kind of miscellaneous. I don't really know where to put them. So this is my one of my two copies of Secret Garden. Um, fish in a tree, I DNF'd. <laughs> not bad. Um, yeah, and then in between them is this thing that holds a few masks and my other candle. Then I have my action shelf. I know it's not a lot, but whatever. Um, I have this Warriors book, which is really broken, but it's signed, so I kept it because I read a lot of Warriors when I was younger. Um, I have Percy Jackson. Yeah, it's a very small shelf of just standalones and action. I used to have an entire action shelf but i got rid of all my warrior books besides this one so lastly are these two picture books um and just some other stuff i have a, a picture here usually but i don't know how my mom is about being on youtube so i pro i just got rid of it and then i have hidden dr peppers that no one's supposed to know about but i guess y'all will know um for whenever i want dr pepper so yeah that's this shelf and the bottom ones are just random thingies above it is just like vinyl a lot of vinyl some scrunchies and then my record player and a guitar just like calendar and stuff like that so this is my first shelf it has very messy fairy lights that one came undone if somebody knows how to put fairy lights upright so then i don't have to tape them please let me know um but yeah that's just that's my first little section of my shelves let's go to the next one Woo! I look like i have my life organized so the lighting for these shelves are going to be a little worse but these are my more favorable shelves we have all of these and they're really cool so let's just tour them right so up here is my twilight um saga before i get a lot of hate please know that I wanted to read these because everybody talks about them and I wanted to be able to have a word in it. So yeah, I have my Twilight books. I don't have Midnight Sun yet because I'm not even through Twilight. Um, whew, so <laughs> a lot to go, sadly. Um, but yeah, to the side, to the left of it, um, 
I have this really cool secret garden book that I got because I was actually, if you look up here, I was actually in a show. Um, I was in the show Secret Garden and I played Mary and so my director gave me this really pretty book he wrote in it. And so it's always had a special place in my heart. So I wanted to put the beautiful book on show. So yeah, that's, that's the shelf. On to the next one. Um, I turned my picture around because I have friends on that one and I don't want any of them to be like all insecure about it. So this is my big like upfront TBR. So I have all of my TBR books on there, but these are the ones I want to read the most. So we have Cinder, A Good Girl's Guide to Murder, Opposite of Always. This one's next for sure. Two Can Keep a Secret. Very lucky with this. Um, they both died at the end. And Simon versus the Homo Sapiens Agenda. Uh, I'm reading these two right now, so I'll have a book wrap-up coming soon on these two in Twilight because I'm supposed to finish them by the end of the month because it's based off my TBR game that I started. So, yeah. This is also connected to my really messy bed. Um, we don't we don't have to talk about that. Uh, and I, I actually, it's my nightstand, so yeah. On to the bottom shelf. So, down here are all of my other TBRs. Um, there's a lot, as you can see. Only one of them is actually on my TBR, and it's this one. I had to read it for school, so it's just here for, until I get a different book to replace it. Um, but yeah, these are all of my TBR, besides those ones that I really want to read. This book right here is The Land of Stories by Chris Colfer, and I read the entire series, and it's my favorite book series. And it's right here because it's signed, so, and it's really pretty. And it's staying up from a candle, if you can see that. Um, a very small candle, but I don't like the smell of that candle, so I'm not missing much. On this side, we have Shiver, Linger. I don't have the third one, and I know it's broken. My dog got to that one as well. And we have Divergent. I'm supposed to be buddy reading this, but I haven't started it yet. So maybe next month. The Fault in Our Stars, which I have no idea what it's about. A Week of Mondays, which I do have the dress jacket for. It's just, I like it better on the shelf like that. So it's gonna stay like that. And The Hunger Games, I don't have the other two because literally almost this entire shelf besides Divergent and George's Secret Key to the Universe and Tell Me Three Things, all the other books I got at one thrift store. So I was kind of lucky with that. Um, over here, I have George's Secret Key to the Universe, uh, my Vampire Diaries, which I do want to read at some point. Life as we knew it, because my mom's wanting me to read it. Tell me three things. I don't know what that's about. And Blue Blood and Masquerade. I have no idea what this is about, but you know, it's fine. And then I have my jar, which I will be introducing all the rules about it next video. And it's really cool, but I had to leave it there for now. And down here, I just have cat treats, um, like literally in my Uno cards for the game. And in my dust jacket, I am going to keep all my dust jackets down here. Um... And if you're wondering, in this one, I literally just have gift cards, so there's not much to see there. But yeah, it's, that is this lovely shelf. So hopefully that wasn't too long. I'm going to hope it's not, but if it was, sorry. Um, I, I know that probably wasn't as long as you anticipated, but I actually don't have that many books. <laughs> um... I'm kind of laying low on buying more until I can read through some of the ones I own because I have a problem with buying books and then never reading them. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I should be having one come out soon. I'm not exactly sure when that will be. I still haven't filmed it, but I have one for my TBR game that I will probably put out on Sunday. It's Tuesday right now, so I'll probably put it out on Sunday because I'm like that or something like that. I, I don't know how I'm going to do it yet. I might have it go every Wednesday um, besides the, the uh, TBR game ones. I'm not sure how I'm going to post yet, but we'll see. We'll see. I don't really know what I would call this fan base yet. I think I'd just call y'all Booklings. It's kind of fun. <laughs> booklings. Hi, Booklings. Like, you know, book, book, book readers and darlings, booklings. That's my fan base. That's what it's going to be called if I have a fan base. Anyway, if you subscribe, you can join the booklings. We are very, very fun. Uh, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed 
And thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you in the next one. Peace!